Hey all, welcome to Share Trek. This is Raj here. And uh, friends, today uh, we are talking about verb therapeutics that we haven't spoken about in a while. In our channel, off late, it has been more of CRISPR therapeutics, Ginkgo Bioworks, and Illumina. Uh, and um, we broke that record by speaking about uh, Intelia. Uh, I did a video recently because there was some good news. And I have always uh, complained that Verve is moving very slowly and in fact I had forgotten all about Verve. But news is that Eli Lilly has partnered uh, with Verve Therapeutics for gene editing in the field of cardiovascular uh, ailments. And the deal includes a 30 million cash payment, 30 million equity investment and up to 465 million for R&D and commercial milestones. Plus, I also want to highlight the cup and handle pattern I find in Verve Therapeutics chart. Uh, price chart so we'll go to trading view towards the end of this video and i'll point out the recent strength in the stock price that said i think it's time for us to dig deeper into this for more details let's get started <music> Hey there gene editing enthusiasts, I have got some exciting news in the world of biotech and big pharma. Eli Lilly has joined forces with Verve Therapeutics to battle heart disease using the power of gene editing. It's like a superhero team up but instead of capes they are wearing lab coats. And uh, here's the deal, uh, Eli Lilly is throwing a whooping 30 million in cash at Verve and they are even investing another 30 million in equity. Talk about a serious commitment, but that's not all. They are also ready to dish out up to 465 million for research and development at Verve. That's a lot of zeros. And so what's the target of this epic collaboration? Well, it's a sneaky little particle called lipoprotein A or LPA uh, in short. Uh, it's the cousin of LDL cholesterol and it loves to cause trouble by promoting blood clotting. Can you believe it? Approximately 11 million Americans have elevated levels of this troublemaker and it's a significant risk factor for uh, heart disease and stroke. Yikes. <laughs> so this is a welcome uh, development for people who are suffering from this kind of a uh, um, uh, phenomenon. But fear not because Verve is on the case. Their mission is to develop one and uh, once and done uh, treatments that will save the day. Uh, they want to kick these chronic uh, care models to the curb and bring some much needed relief to patients. No more endless injections or uh, pill popping or uh, treatments. Here's the juicy part. Verve has some uh, serious competition. Novartis and Amgen are also in the race with their own treatments. But Verve is determined to be the hero that saves the day. They've got their eyes on the price. Even though Novartis and Amgen might be ahead in the race, will they catch up? Only time will tell. Verve's CEO and co-founder Sekar Kathiresan is a true uh, genius uh, in my opinion because he and his lab have discovered some incredible gene mutations that can turn off LPA and protect against heart disease. But let me tell you, it's not an easy task. The gene they are targeting has thousands of letters that can go haywire, making the editing process a bit tricky. That's why Verve is building their very own custom editor. They are not messing around and that's what is taking a lot of time for them. But when they come up with this uh, therapy, I think it will be treating the root cause and therefore it will be way superior to anything else that potentially could come into the market before them. Now Verve's got a full plate and uh, with five targets and six programs in their pipeline all focused on the liver. They are like the master chef cooking up innovative treatments in the, to fight diseases. It's like watching a cooking show but instead of tasty dishes they are serving up uh, ground baking signs. So buckle up my gene editing enthusiasts. The partnership between Eli Lilly and Verve Therapeutics is set to revolutionize the way we treat heart diseases. There's a, uh, there's a feeling that they are on a mission to save lives once uh, one edit at a time and stay tuned for more updates on this uh, thrilling scientific achievement and adventure uh, ongoing at Verve. Uh, with support from Lily now. Remember folks, it's not just superheroes who can change the world. Scientists and researchers are the real heroes among us. And uh, with that said, now I would like you to take to the area that I'm more comfortable with, which is the price chart. Let's look at the price chart and I want to show you the cup and handle pattern that's forming up. So let's go to the TradingView platform. And here we are in the TradingView platform looking at, uh, at the price chart for Verve Therapeutics. This is a cup and handle pattern in my opinion. Uh, it's not as elegant as the other cup and handle pattern we have seen. Nevertheless, I think that this is a cup and handle pattern. This is our neckline. And uh, we have uh, we have decent improvement in price. You can see today it is topping everybody with a 10.99% gain. And now I'm going to give you an idea of what could be the price potential. Potential target. So let's go here. 
I'm going to clone this and change the color so that we can see it distinctly. So here we have it and now I'm going to pull this down. So we have a resistance exactly at 20.82 so I, I believe that if everything goes well there is plenty of uh, gas in the tank for Verve in order to touch 20.82 and officially the target I'm saying is 20.63. So it's just another nine cents or something plus or minus. So uh, it's looking good. We also have movement um, possible out here in the momentum because the RSI is not overbought. There is plenty of room. MACD is also bullish. And again, Lily is a big pharma and uh, once it gets into this kind of a commitment with Verve, it's going to have a lot of positive energy and we can see 10.88% today. So. Um, if there is no major negative news in the overall environment, I think Verve should carry on with this positive potential towards its target. So this is uh, my uh, opinion, my friends. Uh, it's not financial advice. So as always, I would request that you do your own due diligence, consult your financial uh, advisor before you take any steps. Uh, but uh, I had to share this information with you and um, uh, you let me know in the comments what you think about this, um, what do you think about Verve and whether we can meet the price target that I have raised with the cup and handle pattern. But that said now friends our channel has almost 4000 subscribers and we are trying to become a center for genomic investment on YouTube. What would help us is uh, if you all start sharing your opinions in the comment section and also if any of you have good insights, I would be happy to have you as a guest on the show. Let's have a greater intera interaction in the community. Uh, this is your channel as much as it's mine. Uh, with that said, we are just short of 4,000 subs. So please subscribe if you have not already done so uh, to push us across to 4,000. Thanks and have a great day, my friends. It's been a pleasure uh, bringing this segment to you. I'll catch up with you in the next video. Bye for now.